On October 29, 2024, TD, the Spanish Association of Defense, Aerospace and Security Technology Companies, announced that Airtech has successfully developed the Fox I micromissile. This milestone marks a significant advancement in Spain's defense capabilities, as the Fox I becomes the first drone-launched missile produced domestically. The development is part of the ARPA project, which aims to equip remotely piloted aircraft systems, ARPAS, with precise weaponry for modern warfare. The Fox I micromissile was developed in collaboration with the Directorate General of Armament and Material, DGAM. The project is set to enter its final qualification phase in 2025, with plans for up to 100 validation shots to rigorously test the missile's operational performance. Airtech played a crucial role in redesigning its Tarsus W platform, a weaponized variant of the Tarsus 75, under the DGAM coincident program. Notably, Airtech provided 70% of the funding, while DGAM contributed the remaining 30%. The contract with DGAM encompassed design, prototype production, and a series of successful surface-to-surface -surface firing trials. These trials, conducted at the San Gregorio Maneuver Field in Zaragoza and the Las Bardinas Training Ground in Navarra, included a fully guided missile launch equipped with a warhead. The successful outcomes of these tests have paved the way for the next qualification phase, enhancing the missile's readiness for operational deployment. The Tarsus 75, Airtech's Class 1 UAS system, is a light tactical unmanned aerial system designed for observation, surveillance, and integration of light weapons. With a maximum takeoff weight of 75 kilograms and the ability to carry up to 12 kilograms of payload, it achieves an impressive maximum flight time of 12 hours. Its dimensions include a wingspan of 5.2 meters and a length of 3.8 meters, allowing it to operate effectively from various runways and terrains. The Tarsus 75 features multiple launch options, including catapult launches and emergency recovery via parachute, alongside a backup satellite communication system. Its autonomous operational capabilities cover the entire flight plan, including takeoff and landing, while retaining manual control if necessary. The system can reach altitudes of up to 5,000 meters, with an operational video range of 70 to 150 kilometers, making it ideally suited for deploying the Fox I micromissile. The Fox I micromissile, also referred to as the ASM A Fox, is specifically designed for use with small RPAS. It features intermediate inertial navigation combined with semi active laser terminal guidance. With a length of 900 millimeters and a weight of 3 kilograms, the Fox I boasts a range of up to 4 kilometers allowing it to engage soft targets, opportunity targets, and counter unmanned aerial system, CUAS sensors. Airtech's Fox I missile utilizes an internally developed high-performance guidance kit and laser seeker to ensure precise targeting. Its warhead and rocket motor were developed in collaboration with Instalaza, a Spanish defense manufacturer. The warhead is adapted from Instalaza's C-90 munition and features a custom-designed fuse for targeted strikes, while the rocket motor is compact yet stable during flight. The project received additional support from the INTA Subdirectorate General of Terrestrial Systems, which provided testing resources and engineering assistance. The Fox Eye's modular design allows for easy integration across various aerial platforms with minimal software modifications. Optimized for Class 1 UAS like the Tarsus 75, the missile size and versatility enable it to suit a wide range of light aerial platforms requiring precision engagement capabilities. The potential of micromissiles like Airtex Fox I for drone applications is vast, particularly in equipping small unmanned aerial systems SUAS, with efficient, lightweight, and adaptable precision strike capabilities. These micromissiles facilitate tactical strikes on lightly armored targets with remarkable accuracy, minimizing collateral damage. The Fox I's modularity and small size enable its integration with various drone types, promoting operational flexibility across diverse missions. Moreover, its adaptability allows drones to perform close air support and beyond line-of-sight engagements, utilizing onboard sensors and target systems to enhance effectiveness in high-risk environments. This capability offers cost efficiency by reducing reliance on larger aircraft or traditional munitions for specific tactical scenarios, from counter-US engagements to direct fire support. As Airtech moves forward with the Fox I micromissiles development, it positions Spain at the forefront of drone warfare technology, highlighting the growing significance of precision-guided munitions in modern military operations. With the final qualification phase set for 2025, the Fox I micromissile is poised to enhance the operational capabilities of the Tarsus W platform and redefine the landscape of aerial combat in the coming years.